Let's take a couple structures from the AlphaFold database and put them together in a molecular assembly to predict the, the assembly. And we're going to see what something that goes wrong. So the I'm going to start with an experimental structure. It's of human endonuclease. So it's PDB is 2ZIX. Let's just, it's two chains, color them. And I can fetch from the AlphaFold database at the PDB um, predicted structures for each of these chains and align them to these two experimental chains. So I go to Tools Structure Prediction AlphaFold. This is a new tool that was added in September of 2021. So you'll need a Chimera X version newer than that. And I can choose the experimental structure number one and click fetch, and it will get the two alpha fold models. If I hide the experimental structure, here's what it looks like. The alpha fold uh, predictions are colored according to the confidence. Um, blue is high confidence, yellow and orange and red are lower confidence. Um, let's let's uh, recolor these, color this prediction. I'll press the coloring button. Let's color it gray for easier comparison to the experimental structure. So the experimental structure. Uh, to, to simplify this picture a bit, I'm going to color. Um, or First, let me change the helices to cylinders with the menu entry presets cylinders. Just to make it a little simpler. And let's let's hide. Um, let's hide chain B of the of the prediction. And look, focus just on chain A. Okay, so chain A is the purple one, is the experimental structure, and the, the white one is the alpha fold model. And you can see that the, uh, the lower domain uh, has reasonable uh, agreement between the two, the experimental and predicted, but the upper domain is far from, uh, the, the, is far from the correct. And it's easy to understand why uh, that the, those two domains are connected by a flexible linker, um, the lower and upper domain, and the actual uh, spatial positioning of the two is determined by binding to this pink chain. Uh, let me show you one more thing. Uh, there's a simple way to color the regions of the alpha fold model that deviate far from the experimental structure. If I go to the coloring tool and I choose um, C alpha distance greater than three angstroms, maybe I increase that to five angstroms and press this red uh, button, then the red region here are um, residues where the C alpha position is more than five angstroms away you know, between the prediction and the experimental model. So the domain below, not much red, but the domain above entirely in the wrong position.